Hi guys, so I just bought this uh, this um, Kydera DP550S um, digital radio. Now it's a DPMR one, so it's not DMR. It's uh, it's DPMR, which is a different digital standard. Um, but I just thought I'd show you um, show you this. I was really impressed with it. I'll just turn it on. And this is straight out of the box. I haven't had a chance to program this yet, but one thing I like. Oh, sorry. One thing I like about this radio is that it um, has VFO mode on it, so you can select your frequency and you can choose between digital and analog. Um, so you get the usual stuff in the box: the belt clip, the charger, the wrist strap, things like that, um, charging base. Um, this is the radio. It's got a flashlight on the top, volume selects, um, an LED, um, your speaker mic port there. And you push the talk and a couple of function buttons there, um, and the battery. The battery is really chunky, um, really really thick thick battery on there. So this is the radio. I'll just run through some of the menus. So if you click on menu, you got contact. So you've got your contact list in there, um, and you can add a new contact. So you can edit edit one, and um, you can edit the name um, and save stuff as well. Um, then you've got your messages. Oops, oh, sorry. Let me just turn that off. Oops. <laughs> sorry about that. You get your messages, so you can you can go you can put a new message. Oops, oh, sorry. The menus uh, go back. The menus disappear off the screen when they've been inactive for a while. Um, so you can do a new message. You can just type stuff in there. Um, you got your inbox there, and um, any drafts. And you've got your radio settings, so first you've got your mode, so you've got VFO mode, channel mode, and memory mode. Um, I've not worked out the difference between those yet, but that's obviously to go between VFO. So, whereas you've got Kirisun radios, where you can't go into VFO mode, um, you can with this, you can just switch between. Um, so, just menu again, and you can select your mode there. Um, and when you're in VFO mode, you can just type in your frequency. So, so you can just type in your frequency like that. <clears throat> um, okay. Then you got your channel type. So you got analog, digital. I'm not sure what mixer A and D are yet. Um, mixer digital and mixer analog. I'd have to look at what they are. Um, you can uh, select your power level, so high and low. You can, um, not all these menus work depending on what mode you're in, so there's certain modes where you can't do certain things, so you've got your channel display, channel name, CTCSS, which you can't do in digital mode, only analogue, um, scan function, uh, your busy lock, bandwidth, so you can select wide or narrow, encryption there, so you can enable or disable encryption. Uh, your squelch level, so you can set your squelch level, it's easy enough. Your beep tone, um, so you like your radio tones, keypad tones, the tone if you get a message, tone if you get a private call, a group call, what, what have you. Uh, your LED, which is on the top there, you can change that. Uh, timeout timer, vox, um, the vox level. The backlight, you can have it on or off. Off or on. You can have the brightness of the backlight. You can see it goes up and down like that. Radio monitor. I'm not sure what that is. Oh, that's for your FM radio, which I haven't tried that out yet. Battery save. Scan mode. So just the usual. Whether it's a timed carrier or, a, or what have you. Oops, just come out of that, sorry. Um, A&I, I can't remember what that is. I think that's on most radios, I've seen that on the both, and I can't remember what it is, so apologies on that one. Keypad lock. Um, power display, so do your voltage and tell you whether your battery's running low and stuff. Select your language, you'll see English and Chinese. Um, you get your device info, so you've got the model number there, the radio ID, which I've not changed yet, and then all this stuff isn't in. You've got your firmware there, and the, uh, the 
the latest programming date which is in in July I've got the software and lead for this but I've just not done it yet VFO mode so in VFO mode you can set your shift your step you can scan VFO your offset and stuff like that so you can work repeaters and which is which is pretty good um, and GPS now I don't think the GPS works I've turned it on and then looked for my position it doesn't doesn't do anything so I don't think that works I think it's a gimmick or maybe an add-on but again I'd have to do um I'd have to do uh, some some research so yeah so that's uh, that's your menu um, the menu options on the uh, the Kydera DP550S um, you got your signal meter there, uh, it shows you in digital mode on high power, full battery and your frequency so <clears throat> the audio quality is really good, it's similar to what's on the um, what's on um, the, um, the Kirisun radios and it's not too dissimilar to DMR to be honest <clears throat> very good audio um, I've not had a chance to change uh, to check out the um, the analog side of things yet, just digital. But it does work really well. I'm uh, really impressed. This radio was like sixty quid. <clears throat> the only thing I'm not keen on is I don't know if the camera can see it. You've got like it's like a mesh over the speaker there. Can you can uh, make that out on the camera. I'm not too keen on that. I don't like to get any water behind there. It's just going to go straight in, but. Yeah, really, uh, really nice, well-built, sturdy radio. Um, so yeah, so look out for further videos on this, guys. I'll be updating you in uh, in time to come on this. And um, we'll do some more audio tests. Um, the reason why I got this was because um, me and a friend of mine wanted to try them out on seventy centimeters. Um, there's another sort of digital mode. We're not too far from each other, so for simplex, it's really handy. Um, so uh, so yeah. Um, and not many people use DMR, so we're hoping we can uh, sort of get some interest around it um, in the local area. So that'd be pretty good. So stay tuned for more updates on this one, guys. I'll show you the audio. Um, I'll show you an audio um, test in digital mode in uh, in over the next coming uh, coming few days. And uh, as usual, thanks for watching. Seven three for now.